Good morning everybody. Welcome to my creative time with Emma and also welcome to day three of our sneaky peeks. Um, for today we are all showcasing one brand new set called A Thankful Heart and this one consists of stamp a combo of stamps and dies that are sold together and I will just go ahead and just quickly show you the set of dies in this set here. Um, this is them right here. Aren't those super pretty? Um, this is the one I wrote. It says, um, well it's backwards here because I have it turned around, but it says grateful. And then it has four little leaf dies with the little, um, all the little, I guess you want to call it the veins in the leaves. Um, with the little lines, those are all uh, embossed. So when you cut them out, they will emboss. And what I suggest in order for those to come out like really pretty, run it through your cuddle bug machine or whatever whatever machine you have just run it through a couple of times or use a shim that's a good idea use a little shim for it just to make sure you get a lots of definition with your little lines and your leaves okay it'll work just if you do it once but if you really want it to have you know have a really nice definition i would run it through your machine twice okay so i'm going to quickly show you what I made here. Okay, I actually made an invitation because I had a question from someone about maybe a month ago. Um, it's going to be their first time hosting a dinner party for Thanksgiving at her house and she wanted some an idea um, to make up a cute invitation so I suggest she waited because I knew I was coming out with this set already. So what I did, these are all of the leaves in the set, the leaf dies. You see, I'm not sure, hopefully you could see it good. You see how you can see the little, all the little embossed lines in it right there. And I just used my Wink of Stella marker, marker, <laughs> Wink of Stella marker to go ahead and just color in the little lines. And then there goes that die in the set also, grateful. So the one where it says gather here with grateful hearts. That actually is one of the um, the stamp sets that go coordinate with that, okay? And this here, my little frame die, I'm going to show you how I did that in a minute, okay? So and I just added some sequins, some little twine there. And then when you open it, I'm, let me use my, let me show you the set I use for this. This is an existing set I have out already called Let's Celebrate. And it has like party, you're invited, you're, um, you could put kick your heels up, it's party time. And this comes with an actual coordinating die with it. And this I had out already, so I figured this will be a perfect one to you because it has like you're invited to a Thanksgiving, Christmas, Halloween party, you could put dinner, however you want. So I chose to keep since it is like, you know, Thanksgiving, I to keep it as a little bit semi-formal. I went ahead and just put you're invited to a Thanksgiving dinner. And I didn't put four in RSVP because um she said basically it's it's going to be new and she knows everybody's coming so I figured this will be good to show her. Or you could do it this way too and you could put all of them versus four date place RSVP. But I just trimmed it off and I just used the three in the center. Put a little leaf here and there goes another frame. Okay, So I'm going to show you how I did this really quick before I send, show you my last card. Okay, remember those frame dies we showcased on um what day was that on monday okay the dies we showcased on monday i'm gonna put this this way so you can see it in the camera this is just from my vagabond machine this is just that little magnetic um board um that you could get okay now keep in mind you don't have to use a magnetic board i that's what i have okay so what i did was i grabbed okay let me get the correct frames here okay what I did to in order to achieve that effect I went ahead and I just laid my now this is the reason why I like the magnetic sheet because they kind of stay put after you put them down um, if you don't have a magnetic sheet trust me it's not the end of the world just throw some washi tape um, or painters tape on it to hold them down okay so that's basically how you want to arrange your dies okay the little 
the little rectangle dies, you're going to run it through the machine and then when you run it through the machine you're going to come out with one, two, three pieces. The, the piece in the center, you're going to come out with one frame and two frames. So that bigger frame on the outside is how what I use for this one and you'll see you'll have stitching on both sides. Okay, And then I use the smaller frame for the inside. Now for that inside of the card is what I came up with this, okay? I used that layer. So this way I didn't waste anything. Everything got used, okay? So that's basically how I came up with that, okay? With that cutie patootie little layer. Now, for the last card, actually, I figure since we're doing a whole thankful Thanksgiving day today, I wanted to show you the freebie that I am giving away for the first 150 shoppers. Um, you don't have, to, like always, you do not have to add it to your cart or anything like that. This is the stamp I'm giving away. There is always something to be thankful for. Isn't that super duper cute? Um, all I did was just um, do some watercoloring in the background, add some sequence. Um, and that's it. Super simple. I That's my writing always. Um, the other words are just a font. Um, what I did here, because it kind of looks like it's kind of 3D-ish, what I did was I went ahead and I stamped it in black ink and then I went over it again and I embossed it with some um, clear embossing powder. Heat set it and that's what kind of gives you like it looks like the always kind of lifting up. I really like this way this came out so I just wanted to show this to you now that this will be our freebie for Friday for the first 150 shoppers okay so that is it everybody that is what I made with the brand new set we were showcasing today called a thankful heart um don't forget to visit my blog to see if you were the lucky winner of yesterday's um sneak peeks that we showcase and also same thing goes with this one Go ahead and leave your comments on our blogs for a chance to win this set called A Thankful Heart that comes with um, cord uh, stamps and coordinating dies with it, okay? Um, let's see, what else? I think that's it. Oh, and I'm not sure if I said this right, but don't forget to uh, visit my blog to see if you were the lucky winner of yesterday's Sneaky Peaks. And that's about it, everybody. Have a fabulous day. Thank you so, so much for tuning in, and I will see you back again tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you.